Hey guys, so as much as I detest buying anything from GameStop, I just couldn't pass up the offer to pre-order Codename Steam and get the free Majora's Mask pin with it. If I didn't get this pin, I probably wouldn't do an unboxing because who would want to see an unboxing of a single game? But because this came with the pin, I might as well just unbox both of them for you guys. So let's start with the Majora's Mask pin. So I'm a big fan of the Majora's Mask 3D game on the 3DS. I nearly 100%ed it. I got all the masks, I got all the stray fairies, I just needed to get all the heart containers and empty bottles, but other than that, I'm a big, big fan of this game. I think it's in my top three favorite Zelda games of all time. So, let's just open this up. I heard people are selling this item for like 50 bucks on eBay, so I don't want to do that. I cherish my collectibles. If you open it up, it seems pretty easy. Take the box out of the wrapping. So here's what the front looks like. The back, there's nothing on it. Now, just like a jewelry box. Open up, and here is the Majora's Mask pin. Wow, it's really, really detailed. So here's what the front of the Majora's Mask pin looks like. This is a collectible I'm afraid to take out of the box because it's so beautiful that I don't want to wreck it by removing it. Um, I think I'm just going to leave it like this, but I heard on the back there's a emblem that says like Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask 3D. I love this, and I'm glad I picked it up at the codename Steam game. Speaking of the game, let's unbox that really quickly. So I really like the cover art of this game. I'm a big fan of the XCOM series and Fire Emblem, and I heard this is kind of a blending of the two, so I can't wait to try that out. I have heard that some negative things about this game are that the alien turns take forever, and sometimes you can't even see what they're doing because you, you, the camera's focused on the main character. But I do like the steampunk aesthetic and the American history storyline and stuff, so. I heard there's a lot of twists and turns, I can't wait to see what that's all about. Might as well take it out of its shrink wrap right now. Don't want to ruin the case or anything. There we go. I hate when this happens and get one side and then the rest won't come off. There you go. So I know there's probably not a Club Nintendo thing inside. I think this is one of the first 2015 3DS games that supports Amiibo support. Like, and it also has this little Amiibo emblem, which is really cool. I don't have any of the Fire Emblem Amiibos because they're really hard to find, as everybody probably already knows. So when I do pick up Marth Amiibo because I know they're restocking, I'll give that a try with this game. So if you open it up, just pretty standard electronic manual guide and here is the game card art not bad not nothing in the back like other games like Kid Icarus and stuff but otherwise pretty standard video game box and I can't wait to play this and see how it is I'm so happy that I got to receive this Majora's Mask pin because I heard it's pretty rare other than that Thank you so much for watching, stay tuned for any other future videos, and subscribe if you want more.